focus. It is week five. And here's what's coming up. We got the triple coverage of the Sarah St. Francis rivalry. We got the freshman game, the JV game. Ooh, nice hit. And the varsity game for the GSF week five game of the week. This was exciting. A lot of hits, a lot of big plays. My goodness. Stay tuned. We also have the Los Gatos Sacred Heart Prep game highlights. That was a good game. And it came down to the wire. We got Theo and Manalo at the game. And we're going to do something new. We're going to show our GSF uncut interviews. It's been requested, so we're going to give it a shot, show you guys the full conversation. And of course, the GSF Top Dog Awards. But we're going to start with Thursday Night Football. Thursday Night Football, we love Thursday Night Football. It's Santa Teresa on the road at Overfelt and it was homecoming highlights coming up but before we move on I do want to remind everybody about our GSF senior all-star game happening in late December we are currently qualifying players taking in nominations so if you're a coach a parent a mom a dad a guardian and a teacher or even athletic directors you can nominate your athlete at GetSportsFocus.com just go to the front page and You'll see the flyer and fill out the form. Get Sports Focus is brought to you by Summit Partners, leaders in growth equity investing, Ike's Love and Sandwiches, championship level sandwiches every single time, weightsandbars.com. Build your home gym and shop locally from the Bay Area's best fitness equipment experts, and by South Bay Construction a reputation built on trust. I want to see some Royals and some Saints in the All-Star game. Let's go. We're in week five and this game was on a Thursday. So we might as well check it out. Opening drive for the Royals. Fumble. Thanks to Saints D end Jeffrey Kerr. Ball recovered by Isaiah Lozano. Santa Teresa took over deep in the Royals territory and was about to score when John Stowers caused a fumble recovered in the end zone by Walter Smith nice job and speaking of Walter Miller he had an interception right there that was Santa Teresa's ensuing drive and we are scoreless after one quarter. Second quarter. Royals really struggled offensively. Watch this hit by number eight, Joseph Tapia. Knocked the ball loose. And there goes Kerr with the scoop and score. I'd say it was about 58 yards around there. Less than 60 for sure. Seven to nothing, Santa Teresa. Next, Royals possession. Another turnover. Tapia again. I like this kid. He could be a GSF All Star for sure. And just before the half, Overfeld tried to put something together. Stowers with a nice run. He's their playmaker. And he was last week's GSF Defensive Lineman of the Week. Score remains 7 0 at the half. Third quarter, fourth and long. Overfeld punting. Santa Teresa. They got a nice run. They got a nice return here from their speedster, Noah Gardier. He's a senior now. What? Time flies. But a penalty brought it back. Nice run, though. Lucky for the Saints. The ball on the very next attempt. Punt attempt. The ball went over the punter's head and recovered in the end zone by Kerr. Santa Teresa with a safety. And now it's 9-0. And yes, they got the ball back as well. And on their first play, Noah got the ball. And Noah did what Noah's been doing since he was born. 2021, last year's week number two, game of the week playmaker with a sick run. 
Touchdown Santa Teresa, and that made it 16 to nothing. Saints with seven minutes left in the third. And with the lead like that, defense got stingier. Another turnover for Joseph Tapia. He's just a turnover machine. I'm going to call him Mr. Turnover. Next possession for Overfelt. Yeah, another turnover. And this one is going to be the third score for the defense. Joshua Reyes, last year's week two. Game of the week MVP. Got the pick six. That ball was snapped right before the third quarter clock went zero. Overfelt did score late, but this was all Santa Teresa's defense. 23-6 to six is the final Saints. And the Royals, their first loss of the season.